animation is what makes cartoons move, and there's plenty of techniques to do that. All animation is made up of frames, or a sequence of images that play back to back, up to 24 per second. In traditional animation, each frame is drawn by hand, first with rough sketches, then with clean lines and color. This was originally done on paper, and artists could flip between drawings to see the motion. Now they draw on computer tablets with digital pens. 2D rigged animation is similar, but instead of creating a new drawing for every frame, each part of a character is drawn once and assembled together to move at pivot points. Animators pose characters by rotating and stretching these pieces, or even swapping them out for new ones. Rigged animation can also use tweening, which is when the animator creates the main poses of an action and the computer helps to fill in the motion between. In stop motion, animators move puppets one frame at a time to capture each pose on camera. Pose the puppet, take a picture. Pose the puppet, take a picture. And when those pictures play back in sequence, the character moves. Stop motion puppets can bend and twist because they're built with flexible armatures underneath, like metal wires. Computer generated animation also uses armatures. Digital joint chains create the frame of a character, which is sculpted from a mesh of squares to be fully three dimensional. Controllers allow animators to rotate each joint, and tweening fills in the motion between poses. Actions are also fine-tuned with motion graphs, which can adjust things like direction and speed. So that's how animation works, and how artists make cartoons move. At least until computers get smart enough to do it on their own, right? <laughs> right? Oh! <laughs>